On to Thursday's Express now, and a nurse has lost her job for comments she made on TV. Nick, of course, this is a, based on a viral clip, wasn't it? Clip yes. All over. I'm being sacked. Nurse who said Tory voters don't deserve resuscitation set to lose job. I don't, has she actually lost it now? She made this the claim that she had been okay. sacked, yeah. So, now, this was a clip that went round, and people start to say this is cancel culture. So the, the nurse was saying, if you vote Tory, you shouldn't be resuscitated. Now, the problem with that is people say she shouldn't lose her job, she shouldn't be cancelled. But there is a case that she should, because if you're a nurse saying it, that's kind of an issue. It suggests you might let patients die. I'm not saying she would, but the, the phrase suggests that. Now, if Leo Kerr said it on this show, you go, well, that's what he's he says silly things, that's his Was she job. joking, though? He's not a nurse. She was not joking in no, the clip, no. if you look at it. She didn't seem to be. And she called it harsh in the clip. I would go with evil, but she went with harsh. And obviously it's dangerous if you're a nurse. It, 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 it's, I don't know, I, I, this is a tricky one because you, you don't want people to lose their jobs and things. But why does she even think she could say this as well? This so is an interesting question to me. Why do you that is think true. I mean, it? Josh, this is an interesting one. So this was on a Channel mm. 5 debate programme called Britain on the Brink. Mm. She says this comment about how Tory voters don't deserve to be resuscitated. Now, the thing about that is she's not working for the NHS. I think she works for the private sector. But, you know, if I was a teacher still, when I was a teacher, if I w was on a televised debate and I said something equivalent about kids in a school, I would know that that violates my contract because part of the contract was you yeah. can't bring the school into disrepute or the profession into disrepute. Is that really cancel culture? Is that the same thing? It's a fine distinction, isn't it? The yeah. thing is, she said something very stupid, yeah. very offensive and potentially dangerous, as you say. Um, but she did then backtrack pretty much immediately and so said, you think it was like a slip of the tongue? So I mean, she so, wasn't uh, look, thinking you're right. through. You're right. Why she thought she could say it is ridiculous. But, I mean, come on, man. We've said very stupid, offensive things in the past. The fact that she instantly caught herself on it, <laughs> recognised it and said, of course, I would resuscitate them, but it's appalling the way we've been treated. She, she was frustrated. Nick, it, it, Let's be clear, fair, she backtracked because the audience all went, boo, that's awful. Oh, what, she, if she'd been amongst an audience that liked it, she'd have been like, yeah. But what, what does it serve? What function does it serve, actually? Look, I agree, it's a really horrible thing to say. I think it was really genuinely horrible. But what function does it serve having her sacked? Well, look, I don't revel in the misfortune of anyone except maybe James O'Brien. Brian, it, but, but when it's an... Yes, I don't... It's, I, so it's hard for me to sit here and say she should be. So I'm not going to say she should be. I'm saying there's an argument for it because... Because if it's a nurse, the fact, the fact that she thought it was okay to say it, and the fact, it's just, it, it's, it's too far. But it's a bit like, I felt similar when Trevor Sinclair said that thing about the Queen, he said this horrific thing about the Queen. Of course, he can say it. But you just think, how do people end up thinking these things are okay? I think it's because they're in echo chambers. They were in a sort of lefty culture. In, they're, in, they're on Twitter. They get used she, to saying things. But she's a nurse. She's on a TV debate show. People, it's difficult. You know, people say stupid stuff. You've got the adrenaline. She's making, she's trying to make a point. There it's is very that, hard there is that point. Well, they should let people die because they voted for a mainstream... No, yeah, which is an offensive and stupid thing to say. Then she no, immediately backed that, isn't it? If you're a well, nurse, whatever. it's beyond I'm, that. I'm just, look, I think she was an idiot at saying something like I that. Think, uh, whether I think she should a really lose interesting her job. question, though. Yeah. When it comes to cancel culture, what I don't like is when people, they, they think that someone has expressed an opinion that they disagree with, so they target their employers to try and get them sacked. When you say something that is obviously unprofessional in the context of your job, yeah. isn't that you just and violating people's your, lives? I mean, no, I, I you know. I know. It's, 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 a, it's, a, it's a fine one. Someone the other day on Twitter said, oh, J.K. Rowling is saying this about mermaids, but the guy said it 10 years ago. But the thing is, if, you, if you're a paedophile 10 years ago, that's still a problem. People are now using this anti-cancel culture thing to mean anyone who's actually committed crimes or, you yeah. know what I mean? There is a, there is a line. Well, so. anyway, we're, we're never going to resolve that.